Hello Capricorn and welcome to your coffee cup reading. This is a reading for the week of March 6th. This is a general reading. Overall Capricorn, no matter what, any ups and downs this week, there is happiness. For some of you, this is in a great outcome, a successful outcome. For some of you, this is a good time having fun with children, just playing. I do see that kind of energy. It's like feeling great. Um, definitely in the spotlight. Okay, so um, your good energy is drawing in people to you. They smile around you. So I do see that energy. There is joy and happiness around. This is a week that it's best to stay out of your head. Okay, I do feel some of you are kind of this is money worries or you're kind of worried about some things and you're kind of and, and you're holding on to energy, I want to say a little bit too tightly. Um, when I look at this too, it is talking about um, for some of you, this is great. This is looking at long term security, um, starting a financial plan. Um, so this is like. Um, I want to say budgeting, planning, savings. Okay, but don't hold on to energy too tightly. I do feel that energy as well. For some of you, this is someone from, um, this is like an ex. This could be thoughts of your ex. Are your ex wanting to return? For some, this is a general reading. And what I see here, it's not good. It will just start the same cycle over whatever. But I, I can't tell anybody what to do. You know, it's up to you. Um, for others here, if you're single, I want to say be careful of a third party involvement. This person has either a complicated relationship or is not over and done with a girlfriend or boyfriend or something like that. Okay, so I do see that kind of energy. For some of you, this is make it or break it week with a relationship. So this could be a um, deciding to divorce, deciding to separate. So I do see that energy. I do see there could be some interference as well. So this could involve cheating. It could involve um, something that is like happened before and happens again. So there is that energy, I have to say. Um, I do see that for others, this is just like some kind of pain from the past um, that you need to let go of. And there is a healing energy. So I do see that. Um, I do see rebirth. This is really good for some of you. This could be a child, um, that says something surprises you nicely, or just, you know, sometimes children say something and it just triggers something. Um, we learn from kids. They're just so innocent. They just say it. Okay. So I see that that could be an epiphany, beautiful energy here too. I do see maybe receiving a, some kind of a gift, um, and support, don't make any promises you can't keep and be lighthearted with other people's promises as well. So I do see that. Um, beginning stage with love. This could be dating this week for some of you. So that's looking good. Um, there is a strong attraction to someone or something here this week too. Okay, so I'm seeing that. This is a week to purge toxic um, situations out of your life. For some of you, this could be um, some wrenches being thrown in. Somebody comes in and kind of spoils the day or something. I do feel that energy. Be careful not to retract into your past bad habits. Okay. This is like an addiction, whatever it is, everything in moderation, and you do have support around you. So reach out to someone or find some kind of um, ways to resist temptation, I want to say. Okay. I do see love here and someone very supportive who may give you some kind of great advice, or this is you giving someone advice. It could work both ways. So I do see that energy that's looking good and becoming more emotionally stable. So most of you are going to kick an addiction or you're going to um, resist some kind of temptation. So I am seeing that energy. There is messages of love coming in. This is really good. For some of you, this is good news coming in and even thoughts of travel. Now, um, pay attention to your messages this week. There is overall happiness and joy. I do see for some of you, you have some kind of great and brilliant idea, all right? Now, um, your idea is actually guiding you somehow, but you need to kind of put some kind of action into this uh, to bring your idea to fruition. So either that means talk to someone trusted, put it out there, 
Um, I do see that um, advertised, but it's putting some kind of action in it. Otherwise, poof, nothing comes out of it. Okay. So I'm seeing that energy. There's some swift, sudden change is po possible as well, too. So looking at that, for some of you, this could be last minute travel plan. Okay. Interesting. All right, Capricorn, that is your reading for the week of March 6th. I hope you have a fabulous week and I will talk to you next week for your next reading. Bye for now.